in Pflugerville, there is about $126,000 worth of unpaid lunch charges in the district. There's two teens who recognize this and are hoping to help out. KXN's Blake Devine is here with how they're raising money to help pay off that debt. Good morning, Blake. Good morning, Tom and Sally. Back in April, the district put in place a policy that any student owing more than $6 in their school lunch account had their main entree taken away and substituted for a sandwich. So two teens decided to step in and lend a helping hand. Kids do get made fun of for uh, if they do have the cheese sandwich or if they do have the alternative lunch. We personally saw students get their lunch taken away and given a humiliating alternative lunch, and we knew we wanted to help. John and Max Amador have both been busy this summer. You give out a and you can't. Creating a nonprofit to pay off their school district's debt so that their peers no longer receive an alternative lunch. We believe everyone deserves that right not to have to worry about the security of what they're going to eat and if they're going to eat something nutritious. Setting up shop through this simple stand. They've raised over $2,000. It means that this is a problem that people recognize and they care about solving, which is a very good thing. But there's more work to do as they're trying to raise awareness and grow as an organization. Hopefully, we can pay off all of the student debt to the district. At the end of the summer, all money raised will be donated directly to Pflugerville ISD's Food Services Department. Even after we uh, pay off all the debt. We will continue to help families in our district. Now we reached out to the school district who responded with the following statement quote. We have been so impressed with Max and John who are behind this nonprofit raising funds to help pay off this negative fund balance. They've set an ambitious $50,000 goal for this year and every dollar they raise means less money diverted from other school programs and both boys will host a fundraising event this week at the Red Robin in North Austin. And to donate, you can find the link listed on our website.